accompanied by a police orchestra, dozens of officers from different departments descended on Khrushchev, Kyiv's main thoroughfare, to represent the police and celebrate their professional holiday. I send my greetings to all the personnel of the National Police. I wish them health and to prosper, both in their service and in life. All the best to them. The police use this opportunity to communicate with the public, including children. We do it so that a child understands that a Ukrainian police officer is their police officer. It's not some guy who's intimidating. It's a guy who protects their peace and quiet. Passers-by even had a chance to get in the front of a police car and learn more about the special equipment used by officers. See, there's a display here. You can see everything that it's filming, and you can even make photos. Everything is recorded. That's why if someone tries to deceive an officer, we'll have the proof of everything on record. The police are the ones who protect people. When someone steals something, the police will chase and catch them. And of course, after that, they will return the stolen things. Members of the public enjoyed taking selfies with patrol vehicles and getting to know the police dogs and horses. Dogs are selected for police service at the age of six months. They are tested for compatibility with specific kinds of work, be it detecting explosives, drugs or people. We have 20 horses. We constantly control all the parklands of Kyiv, as well as mass events like rallies and football games. Similar events were held for Police Day in many Ukrainian cities. Their aim is to popularize the job of a police officer, often the most visible role in law enforcement. Currently, the National Police of Ukraine employs 130,000 staff. Reported by Tamara Kononenko, UATV.